Hey guys. So today we're out at the um, Alameda Antique Fair. I'm meeting a friend here, uh, Stephanie Law, and we're gonna go and look for frames. She's the one that introduced me to this show. Um, but yeah, it's pretty, pretty amazing. So I don't know if we'll make it through the whole thing in one day or if we'll uh, get exhausted and leave early. So <laughs> anyways, this should be fun. stuff we find. Um, yeah, so Stephanie introduced me to this antique fair and we've been kind of, kind of coming. Every, like yeah. three or four months or so. Yeah, thereabouts. So hopefully we find some cool stuff and I'll show you later what I uh, end up with. I like that. It's like a door on the side. I know, like somebody it's just stuck a door cat. there. <laughs> it's like it was a built-in or something. It, it just it's needs a, a secret too. compartment. Oh, space. <laughs> I know, I'm like, where would I put that? So Stephanie is asking me about the ears on my camera. Um, so they are ears. They are not ears. <laughs> they look like fuzzy cat ears. They, they are um, things to block the wind from coming in the microphones. Their ears. But their ears. I mean, it, look, look, it looks like I have a little raccoon or something. <laughs> hey, it's um, it adds character. <laughs> look like rings. Weird. <laughs> Some palette knives. <laughs> some very loved palette knives. It's not been cleaned in a while. Oh, these are so cute. So you can hold it. I've never seen it like that before. It feels like it should be in something. <laughs> Look at that! It's, it's so tiny! <laughs> it's the biggest that it goes. <laughs> oh my goodness. We found some cool, what is it, watercolors? Oh my yeah, it's gosh. Yeah, golden silver watercolors. So I don't know how they'll cool. look if I give it a shot. And tiny little blades. Stephanie caved. I succumbed. <laughs> so she's treating us to some kettle corn. Naomi's first kettle corn? Well, like second time, maybe. <laughs> Third? This is this the one. small. Right, look at it. 
It's like, it's huge. It's a lot of popcorn. There's one that's like, this big? This big? I don't know. You think it tastes as good as it smells? After two yeah. hours, yeah. Okay. <laughs> it never ends. There's so many cars here. There's so many cars gone. So, yeah, well, they're all gone now. But, so we found some cool stuff. And yeah, I think we're done. Loaded down. For today. Tired. Hot. Hot. But, yeah. but happy. But <laughs> happy. <laughs> Stephanie has some of my stuff in her cool little cart. And that's been super handy. And we gotta drop it off at my, my car and then go home. So. So I'm home now. And I just wanted to show you real quick some of the things I picked up at the antique fair. Um, yeah, it was a really good day. There was a lot of frames there that were massive. Like, there's some days I've gone where um, we've just found a lot of small frames and maybe not so many big ones, or we've just seen not many at all. They're all plastic or, you know, kind of not ones that are worthwhile. But uh, yeah, today we saw a lot of really, really big frames and ones that were maybe more meant for like oil painters. So they're kind of like a, like a thicker, bulkier frame. So, didn't end up getting too many of those, but I did pick out. So I got these big guys, and they're not, they're not terribly huge. Like, I mean, when you think about adding a mat to the center of this, that's not gonna be a very tall painting, or a wide painting, depends on which way I hang them. So, kind of excited about that. And this I picked up for our scrap paper bin, some brushes to just kind of play around with. Those are fun, super cute. Probably the most impressive find. This, I get some coral and put it inside because I've always wanted some. And then the last thing was this tiny, really sweet micro frame that just needs a little bit of maybe some touching up on the paint, but yeah, it even has a back, which is surprising. Um, yeah, it's cute. So that's what I picked up. I hope you enjoy this and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.